uh, taking on that objection, which is indeed, I think, the most serious objection that is made to my point of view. And I'll just, I, haven't, I can't tell you the whole chapter now, but if you'll let me just try two things quickly. First, definitely not true to say that Nazism and fascism were secular or atheistic. Um, all the fascist uh, powers, uh, Mussolini, Franco, Salazar, the, that belt of dictatorship in southern and central and Balkan Europe, all had a, an official treaty with the Roman Catholic Church. Uh, their, half of their ideology and uh, support diplomatically was supplied by it. Uh, Hitler never left the church either, um, benefited a lot from the first treaty he ever signed, which was a concordat with the Vatican. Prayers for his birthday were said by order of the Pope uh, every year until the very end. Uh, the Protestant church doesn't come very much better out of it either. That's why mm -hmm. the churches keep apologizing, as you must have noticed, for their, their role in the Nazi period. They don't do that for no reason. That's not secularism. But in the communist case, which is officially atheist, I'll just try and say this quickly. Till 1917, everyone in Russia was told, millions and millions of peasants and ignorant people, for hundreds and hundreds of years, that the ruler of the state should be something like a demigod. The Tsar of Russia was not just an absolutist dictator, but he was the head of the Russian Orthodox Church. He was above humanity and a bit below the heavens. Joseph Stalin, who trained as a priest, by the way, that, that may be irrelevant, would be an idiot if he didn't take advantage of a mm -hmm. huge reservoir of credulous, servile, frightened, worshipful people who were ready-made for him by the backward Christian feudal past of Russia. So, mm -hmm. well, it's very easy for me to emulate that. I can have my own inquisition, which he did. I can have my own heresy trials, which he did. I can produce my own miracles, which he did with Lysenko's mm -hmm. biology growing, he promised, three harvests a year. It, it, it's a, an emulation, as is North Korea, of a religious state. Um, Excellent, what, by for, the way. For me to, for, for, our, for your criticism to, be, to hurt me, you'd have to say that there was once a country, or that there is one now, that adopted the teachings of Spinoza and Thomas Jefferson, mm -hmm. Thomas Paine, Albert Einstein, and then went into bankruptcy, misery, famine, dictatorship, and concentration camps, and you will not find that that is the case. I urge you to take a look at this book. Even if you completely disagree with Christopher Hitchens, the one thing that you will not be is is not entertained. He is he is extraordinary with the use of the language, and if you love the language as he does, this is an extraordinary book. But his use of argument is as good as it gets, folks. God is not great, the name of the book. This is KGO. Christopher, thanks.